Hey guys, it's John here for another episode of the Daily Picks, where I uh, look at the games that are on tap for the day, and I uh, talk about them and give you my predictions. So, there's six games today, and three teams are going to be, no, four teams are going to be making their season debuts, as the Sabres uh, host the Flyers, the Flames host the Sharks, and the Oilers um, are going into Vancouver. So we'll start out with the Sabres hosting the Flyers. It's the Sabres debut. Uh, the Flyers lost at home yesterday to the Penguins 2-1. to one. Um, This is like... Um, this. I was going back and forth in this game because I wasn't sure because the Sabres are home. Ryan, I, I have a feeling the Sabres will do much better this year. I'm not sure they'll make the playoffs, but they'll do much better this year. But then I thought back to the Flyers game from yesterday and... I, I Brizgalov really he he played Brizgalov played very well. That that game was not his fault. And I I can't see the Flyers starting 0-2 this year, so uh, I have Flyers four, Sabres two. Now we'll look at the uh Flames as they host the Sharks. Both teams will be making their season this is their season openers. And I'm not. We're not really sure what to expect from the Flames. I mean, they acquired Dennis Wideman in the off season, which I thought was a good move. But Aginla, Kiprasov, all those guys are getting older. The, the Flames are an old team. I mean, they they are a very old team. And the Sharks, they have like some old, like, core like in Thornton and Marlowe and Dan Boyle. But they also have a, a good young group in uh, Pavelski, Kocher, Brent Burns. Uh, Mark Edward Vlasic, and um, Niemi in goal, obviously, Stanley Cup winner. And um, another game, I was, I'm was i not really sure to what to expect because it's in Calgary, but I have the Sharks winning 4-1 just because I, I, I feel like the Flames are going to struggle again this year and the Sharks, I think, will make the playoffs again. So this is just going to help propel them. Next game, probably the biggest game of the day, as the Rangers have their home opener against the Pittsburgh Penguins, two elite, two, two of the elites in the Eastern Conference. Penguins are coming off a 2-1 win against the Flyers, as I said earlier, and the Rangers are coming off a 3-1 loss in Boston. And it's the Rangers' home opener, but um, I, I, this is, I mean, people are predicting these two teams to potentially meet in the Eastern Conference Finals, along with maybe Boston, but... um. I, I mean, same kind of deal with the Flyers, so I don't I can't really see the Rangers losing their first two, but the I the Penguins are just I they're too good this I mean they have a very balanced I, I mean Brandon Sutter I mean they lost Jordan Stahl, but Brandon Sutter came right in yesterday and he played a, a heck of a game, and Flurry showed that he's an elite goalie. But, um, so yeah, I have Penguins 2, Rangers 1. Now we'll go over to the Stars and the Wild, as the Wild host the Stars. Both coming off wins from yesterday. Both had great games. Yager and Whitney uh, each had, oh, Yager had four points, and Whitney had a goal in their debuts. And uh, Parise had two assists, and Heatley had two goals. And I'm just going to give it to the home team here. Wild 3, Stars 2. Next is the Canucks and the Oilers. And uh, Canucks had a disappointing 7-3 loss to the Ducks, and the Oilers are making their season debut. But I can't see the Canucks losing back-to-back -back games at home to start the season. So, Canucks 4, Oilers 2. Last game is the Coyotes hosting the Blackhawks. The Blackhawks went into L.A. and ruined their King celebration. They won 5-2. And I have a feeling they're going to do a similar thing to the Coyotes today. I have it Hawks 4, Yotes 1. So those are my predictions for the day, guys. I hope you liked it. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll be doing these all the time, but I'll be doing them a lot. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I'll talk to you guys next time. We started from the bottom, but we race into the top. So we never ever sleep, but got dreams of getting on. And times are looking hard, but you know we'll never stop. And we do it for the fans, cause these fans are all we got. But we ain't in this alone. We thankful for your help. I'm rapping heavyweight and reaching for that.